the story behind my stepsister and I's feud and why we don't talk. That's why I don't talk to Mary Ellen. That was one of the main reasons why I don't talk to Mary Ellen. And, and then they probably got the people, a couple people from Oak Valley who they freaking despised me because they were fat and jealous of me. So I'm glad that worked out for the friends that came in to Oak Valley Pizza that were at that party when I was 20 years old. I'm glad that worked out for you. Okay? Because you just have no clue on what I've been through two years before that. Now do you? Do you? And those fat bitches knew I did not do anything wrong. Everybody from Oak Valley Pizza knows damn well I was a good girl until two years after I lost my first child. And that fucking bitches from Oak Valley Pizza who decide they're gonna fucking lie. Go right ahead. I'm glad that's gonna burn you in your conscience. I'm glad you all have a conscience about it. from Oak Valley Pizza, Carrie, Carrie and all them, I'm glad that's worked for you all. You know, these people are digging so far back to try to justify why they stole my kids, and then they're trying to get me on anything and everything to put me in jail so they can keep the kids they stole. You're not doing it. You're going to jail for kidnapping. Face the fact that you're dead. You're dead and you're going to prison for life. You're the walking dead. Now, if I would have opened my eyes and ears about what the fuck was going on, Back in 2003, because it was before I fucking relapsed, I'm glad that worked for you. I'm glad that worked for everybody who wanted me to relapse and fall on my face. I'm glad that worked. But guess what? I ain't stupid down to nobody's goddamn level no more. You know why? Because I realized the damage you've done to my fucking kids. And I want to make sure that every, each and every one of you pay for everything you did to my children. Any freaking needle you stuck in my kid. Any drug that you drugged my kid up with. Anything that you did to my children, I'm going to make sure the judge throws the whole book at you. I hope the judge throws the fucking key away. Locks you away and throws the key away. Puts you in that fucking cell and throws that key away for what you've done to me and my children. Because it's inhumane. You are... You... If you came back out, you just do it to somebody else. So you don't need to be in fucking public. You don't need to be there. You don't need to be, you are a mens reus, put it that way. Your history, your mens reus. You're mental. You are mental. And if you think you're gonna get away with it, you're not.
Alright, let me shut this off. I'm here. Praise be to God. Hallelujah. Amen.